Cardio Confusion. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you, wherever you may be in the universe. If you're tuning in from Andronis, if you're tuning in from the Pallades, you know who it is. <laughs> Swole Yoga, your boy T. And it's a yeah, I did get the day wrong yesterday, didn't I? But I got the date right. So now I know today Calories is Thursday. And, and uh, they're telling me I burned 390 calories. But anyways, I just want to talk about accepting yourself today. There's so many people walking around that hate their bodies. They hate their lives. They hate the fact that they wasted so many precious years on relationships that failed. Uh, they hate the traffic that they're driving in. So many people are, are, are not accepting of the life that they have. They're always reaching for more. Um, there's a thing called catalog-induced anxiety. And that's probably for you smart people out there who read. <laughs> Anyways, basically, the poor people look at what the rich people have and they desire it also. And there's nothing wrong with desiring things and materials and money. But I would definitely edge you to accept what you already have. To actually want what you already have. To feel what you already have as something good and something positive. Because by doing that, you are opening up a vortex, a vacuum, to have more of what you desire. This is truth. And you do not know how, have to know how this works in order to do it. All you have to do is live with an attitude of gratitude and watch your life unflower. It will unflower in directions that you would never even imagine. Because that's what's happening to me. And it's not scripted. It's not something that I wrote down and planned. But it's the most amazing experience that I've ever had. Going with the flow of what is me. Uh, in order to do this, you do have to tune into yourself. And tuning into self is very fucking scary. Because you're going to see a lot of things about yourself that you do not like and that needs to change. Including myself. But accepting of who you are right now, what you are right now, your situation right now is the beginning of a new you. You have to be able to see life for what it really is. For example, I lose subs every few days. I gain subs every few days. That's because someone probably subs my channel because they liked one video. And then they see something else and they don't like it. And it offends them. One thing you must know, a wise person can never be offended. So if you're offended by anything you see by my channel on YouTube and life, you're not wise yet. You've got so much to learn. Because wisdom comes with compassion and understanding. And a lot of people with intellect do not have that. They are regurgitating what they have read in books. And they're using their minds, which is less than 10% of their whole being, to evaluate what is right and what is wrong and creating a, a world of duality. But I don't want to get too philosophical on you this morning. I just want you to know that accepting yourself is so powerful. Accepting how you are right now is so powerful because then if there are some things you don't like about yourself, you have the power to change them instead of being depressed in them and not making any moves. So let's practice a little bit of self-acceptance today for the good, the bad, and the ugly. <laughs> That's why I love living. Damn! 600 million! <laughs>